This is 4 a.m. Could see a few of those mainly in the highlands, but it's this system we're going to keep an eye on heading into tomorrow morning. So if you're watching from the NRV, you might see some snow showers developing anywhere between 7 a.m. and 11 a.m. tomorrow. But keep in mind, the road is actually very warm right now, so most of what we see tomorrow is going to accumulate on the cars and on the grass. Now in Roanoke, you're probably looking at a start time anywhere between 10 a.m. and 1 p.m. as far as the snow showers go, but also could be a little bit of a mix in parts of the area with snow lasting the longest in the highlands through tomorrow afternoon. So this is 2 p.m. You see areas east of the Blue Ridge warm enough for it to be mainly rain with a few wet snowflakes mixing in, but a mix of snow and rain in the Roanoke Valley, keeping on to some snow in the NRV in the highlands. Then as we head through the later part of the afternoon by supper time, we're seeing snow to the north, mainly rain to the south with things then tapering off by tomorrow evening. So areas in the pink in the highlands and also in Craig County around Mountain Lake could see anywhere from one to three inches of snow. Areas in the white, the Roanoke Valley, the I-77 corridor, the New River Valley, Lynchburg could see up to an inch of snow. Now keep in mind, that doesn't guarantee that you see an inch of snow on the ground, especially because the ground temperatures right now are actually fairly warm. So why do we keep saying that? Okay, back in December, the sun very low in the sky, which is why anything that we see in December and January usually sticks. But here we are in March and the sun angle is 47 degrees, so it's a little higher and the road is able to warm up a little more. In fact, road temperatures right now in the 50s and 